Okay guys, so if you hear a lot of noise outside this door, that's because there's two camera crews in my house. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, I think I briefed over this in one of my recent Gabmas vlogs, but Nikki and I are currently filming a reality show. And on top of that, I'm filming a commercial today. I'm about to get my skin all nice and prepared because I'm about to get my makeup done and film a commercial. A commercial? For my own fragrance. I'm so excited right now. So yeah, I'm about to get my skin nice and prepared for this commercial. If you guys didn't know this, I have my own fragrance coming out. It's called Beautiful Mess. Pre-order is November 13th. There's currently a countdown on the website linked down below and it's officially for sale November 30th. But yeah, before we get into everything going on today, I do want to make sure that my skin looks good because not only am I going to be in a commercial today, which I feel like skin needs to look amazing even though it's just for perfume you know what i mean like commercials are just very like up close and bougie so i need my skin to look good today for that and also because the reality show is documenting the bts on top of me blogging so i just need my skin to look good a lot is going on i'm a busy girl this gabmas season so my skin has been behaving but i don't know if you can see there's like little like dots here and here in here and i just feel like of all times my skin just isn't the best right now so i feel like sometimes when you wake up and there's just like minor like little lumps and bumps you can easily fix that with a spin brush i know i'm always plugging in this guy but this is the brilliant spin care system from duval it's so awesome it literally gets in there i don't use my hands to wash my face anymore because i noticed back in the day that's what was causing my acne the spin brush comes with five heads it comes with a body brush another cleansing head a file and a pumice and you get all of this in one Actually, I have another code for you guys because it is Black Friday season. So this new code, if you guys want to get the same spin brush as me, the code is Black Friday for 75% off. Mm, this cleanser never gets old. I'm using my Gentle Face Cleanser from X Easy. Whenever my skin is being like super sensitive, I always use the Gentle Face Cleanser. You guys know the drill. I make my own skincare on the website called Mix Easy. This is the face cleanser I'm using today. So there's a makeup artist coming to do my makeup today, which is a first. I usually do my own makeup makeup because I literally don't trust anyone but that's gonna be a surprise she's a youtuber and a tiktoker and I love how she does makeup so she's gonna come do my makeup for this commercial today so my skin has to look good I feel like these brushes just feel so good on your face in the morning oh my god if you guys like how back scratches feel or like when people play with your hair it's like the same kind of sensation but yeah this is where I need to exfoliate I use spin brushes also to exfoliate my skin as like a really pretty base before I get my makeup done or before I do my makeup for something important I feel like if you don't have a spin brush and you just use your hands you're like half-assing your skincare so that's why i'm always giving you guys this code so that's why i'm always giving you guys this code it's literally 75 percent off it's a great gift for christmas i know that everyone in my family wants one this year so i'm gonna be giving them these and when i had the fancy sleepover last year i handed these out and you guys love them a lot of you guys comment down below that it's helped your skin so much so like i said i'm gonna link everything down below so that you guys can get these for 75 percent off or if you want to get them as christmas presents for friends or family this skincare smells so good i choose the fragrance yeah you get to pick out your own fragrance for your skincare on top of the ingredients that are in these bottles but i chose the milk and honey fragrance and for those of you guys who do make your own skincare on the mix easy site definitely choose that fragrance because it smells like dessert it smells so good you guys know i love sweet smells Oh, you guys, do you see my new shower curtain? I got this for the Christmas season because it looks super whimsical and fairy tale like. You guys know I love the Nutcracker. It just reminded me of the Land of Sweets. You guys will see in the commercial that I took that to a whole other level. So I'm using toner. And now I'm using my face cream from Mix Easy. It also smells like milk and honey. So Mix Easy is a website where you get to create your own skincare like I was telling you guys about. I mentioned this in like every vlog, but if you're new, hey, I make my own skincare. The website walks you through what ingredients you use what for according to your skin type. I have combo skin and it walks me through what ingredients are beneficial for that. And if I click on an ingredient, it tells me on top of the visual what that ingredient does and how it helps you. This is truly how I cleared my skin. I'm also going to give you guys a code for Black Friday on this site and you Use the code black 25 for mix easy for 25% off and yeah I think my skin is ready for makeup let's go to the closet and get glammed So 
the first part of the commercial, I'm I'm in the princess cave and I wake up. I don't know which pajama to wear. It's either the blue set. You guys know this by now. I accidentally order two of like the same thing all the time. So there's two, <laughs> there's two like of the ivory set. So I actually think I'm gonna go with the blue set. So I guess I got two of this set for nothing. Um, so yeah, Val. You guys know Val, Champagne Dreams, Fancy Sleepover. <laughs> she got me macaroons this morning from Lauderay because she's from New York City. They're both from New York City. Yeah. I'm so jealous. I want to live there. But she got me macaroons for breakfast because I asked her last night. She asked if I needed anything and I asked her to get ribbons from Lauderay for my hair for the Land of Sweet scene. I'm wearing that pink dress right there for the Land of Sweet scene. There she is. Look at her and, and all this. But yeah, I'm super excited. I'm excited for you guys to get this. You guys remember, the pre-order is November 13th. Actually, by the time this is uploaded, there's already been a pre-order, but you can get this on Cyber Monday, November 30th. working on the next look so far we did this like blue nightgown look the natural makeup and natural hair then we started getting a little more glam when i was baking with the pistachio colored ribbon the baking outfit and now we're getting me all done up for the land of sweets i'm about to go in front of a green screen and we're where i have this like bubble ponytail jackie did this amazing rose gold look yeah we used these here i don't know if you can see them so pretty look at my lips they look so beautiful. I never ever wear makeup this natural and this beautiful. Like guys, I know you love this. We're using Jackie, okay? We're using Jackie from here on out. because I've never had my makeup done so natural to the point where I love it. Usually I wanna just like cake it all on. They know that. And now we're gonna add the Latteré ribbon, the pink and the lavender one together because I'm gonna throw on that Sugar Plum Fairy like tutu dress. I'm so excited. <laughs> Hey boos, so this is the final look. I'm not wearing this in front of the green screen. I'm just wearing this like little ballet jacket to the hotel where the green screen is because it's just already chilly out even though it's only November, what, 6th? It's November 10th. <laughs> but yeah, this is my dress. I look like the sugar plum freaking fairy and I'm wearing these Ted Baker pumps. It's just so beautiful. Let me go to this mirror. My closet is a literal mess right now, guys. <laughs> Please ignore it. It's been a really long shoot day, but this is the dress. And these are my heels. I'm going to show you what it looks like when I'm in front of the green screen without the jacket on. I really freaking love this look. It's just, uh, it's so magical. It just definitely brings Gapmas vibes. And I feel like I look like my perfume bottle now. Wow, okay, so I'm literally sitting on my bidet talking to you guys. 
drinking wine. This is so funny. But honestly, the lighting in this white bathroom is just so good and the acoustics are really good. The only thing that kind of sucks is the bidet making that whatever noise this is. I was gonna call it white noise, but it's a toilet noise. Anyways, right now I'm in one of Colin's t-shirts and taking out my hair is going to be a process, although I don't want to take it out just yet. I just think it's so cute. But at the same time, I wouldn't want to wear this in public, so I probably should take it out. Like, tonight but I have like a story a mini story time for this vlog that I have to tell you guys because yesterday was just a lot and I really thought I was going to have to cancel my fragrance shoot today so if you guys didn't know this Nikki and I are also filming another reality show literally right now we've been for the past three weeks and we've been keeping it on the DL. We've still been filming Nikki and Gabby. I've still been posting fancy vlogs. Nikki's still been posting her vlogs and yeah I've been still doing fun things like what I did today like my fragrance shoot. But anyways the days that we're not filming Nikki and Gabby or vlogging or doing our extracurriculars like Blood Queen's music and fragrance <laughs> Gosh, we're doing so much. On the days we're not doing that, the camera crew loves to dedicate just really cool days, like dedicated just to the show. Because really, the purpose of our reality show is following Nikki and I through everything that we do. Because everyone always asks Nikki and I, how do you manage to do X, Y, and Z all in one day or all in one week? And that's how the reality show picked us up. They were like, we noticed you two girls do so much stuff. Your lives are totally busy with work and relationships and your sister relationships. So they're just literally following us around. Look at this fucking boudet, I, I can't. Unlike other reality shows we've done, we're not taking a trip to get content. The content is literally just following our everyday lives. With that being said, yesterday was quite the shit show. <laughs> so yesterday was, I guess, what you could consider a day off for Nikki and I. Therefore, the reality show company set up an Airbnb for me, Nikki, me, and Colin and our older sister and Rachel were there as well and in this episode we're at this Airbnb on a lake there's a hot tub and when there's like a hot tub in an Airbnb and people are going like in and out of the house the floors get super fucking slippery and the producers were making us cocktails <laughs> Here I am, night two, drinking wine, but no, I swear I'm only drinking this right now because it was a really long work day and it's been pretty stressful the last few days. But for this episode, the producers wanted us to be drinking cocktails. And so slippery floor cocktails, not a good mix. So I slipped really badly on the floor. Like there's a hallway, there's a bathroom and then the kitchen. And I was like running out of the bathroom to go into the kitchen and I did a banana peel slip sideways and I banged the back of my head into the wall Wall, left a dent in the wall my head literally left a dent in the wall and then like 10 minutes later I started forgetting things this was last night and I started freaking out because I had a concussion before when I was younger and those are pretty big deals my brother especially he had to like take off of school for a week or two when he had a concussion so I can't remember anything and I just remember my brother when he had a concussion and he couldn't remember things and then I remember when I was figure skating when I was younger and I had a concussion and couldn't remember things and when you get concussions you have to take off like a week or two of like school or work and I have obviously so much like set up and plan for work for the next from now until Christmas and even after Christmas. I don't have time to have a concussion, let alone with a fragrance commercial the next day. So I didn't realize I was forgetting things until people started like questioning, wait, you don't remember you said that? And I was like, no, I don't remember I said that. And then I started forgetting like big details. And then I got nauseous and felt like I was gonna throw up. But I forgot that I had a mixed drink, actually a few mixed drinks before I slipped and fell. So my hypochondriac ass I was like, oh my god, oh my god, I probably have a concussion. And I was freaking out thinking I was gonna have to cancel this fragrance shoot today. When in reality, I drank tequila mixed drinks. I didn't know what the producers made the drinks with. They eventually told me there's tequila in the cocktails. So I had tequila cocktails, slipped and fell, which is very normal to fall when you drink tequila. One tequila, two tequila, three tequila floor. So I slipped and fell, which is normal, I guess, when you have tequila and a slippery floor. But forgetting things is also very normal after you drink tequila. I had no idea there was tequila in these mixed drinks. And also, consequentially getting nauseous after drinking tequila. That's also very common. So here I was about to cancel my fragrance shoot because I thought I had a concussion and I didn't, I'm fine. After I threw up, I felt totally fine. My mind was fine. I didn't even have a bump on my head. So I was like, there's no way that I could have a concussion. But at the end of the day, I've had a concussion before in the past and I never had a bump on my head when I had a concussion. I know the first sign is obviously hitting your head and then the second sign is throwing up. But yeah, I just have had a very hectic last two days. This shoot took like, what, 10 hours? It, it was a really long shoot. And then yesterday we have like a 14 hour shoot day for the 
reality show, and then the day before that was Nikki and Gabby, it's just, and then the day before that was Fancy Logs, it's just, there's always something, I'm not complaining, I love my job, but yeah, imagine doing all this and you have a boo-boo on the back of your head. I was so scared when I was laying on that bed. And I was so scared the equipment was gonna fall on my head. My head is still sore in the back. It's sore to touch, but there's no bump. I did leave a dent in the wall, but God knows. I don't think I had a concussion, but those uh, side effects were pretty alarming last night. And I'm just totally thankful that I'm okay and that I was able to shoot today. And that's my rant. Now let's go try to take out this hairstyle. <laughs> How on earth? Oh my god, and I have this tight hairstyle on my head. Ow. It like hurts right here. All this fake hair really hurts your scalp. Like it like pulls at it and then with like a head injury. Oof. Oh, this is a concept. Those like bubbles like made really cool curls in my hair. I don't know. Ow. Okay, that wasn't... <laughs> That wasn't as crazy as I thought it would be. I might leave my hair half up like this till tomorrow because we still have another like day or two left to film the reality show. And you know what? It's just so much easier to get ready for call time when your hair is already done. So, so I think I'm gonna braid my hair as is and then just go to sleep and then take out the braid and it'll be like done for tomorrow. But anyways, I'm gonna close this vlog because it's getting a little long or so I think so. But yeah, here's one more look at the perfume. I'm so excited to see how this fragrance turns out. Thank you, Jackie for coming to do my makeup. I'm in love with how this makeup looks and guys, I think I finally found myself a makeup artist that I'm gonna use now so that I don't have to do my own makeup anymore. So yeah, make sure to pre-order your Beautiful Mess bottle if you haven't done so yet. It's 100 milliliters and it's a huge bottle. It looks like this. It looks like a little cake pop on the cap and it has my signature Beautiful Mess logo on it. I'm just so in love with this perfume. It smells so good and I can't wait till you guys know what it smells like too. I'm really hoping I can make a skincare line or body care or candles with this fragrance because I love it that much but you know a girl can dream a girl can manifest and I have proved to myself that manifesting is a thing and that dreaming is not stupid because anything is possible when you don't give up I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next Gabby's vlog fancy vlog <laughs>